All right, let's look at the two bank shot. This takes a little bit more planning, a little more visual planning here. Um, let's imagine the ball, let's see, two bounces. I think if I shot it somewhere down in this region, it would bounce somewhere over here and then into the hole. I think this would be the motion that might work. Now, watch carefully uh, how I go about doing this. I'm going to um, notice it was going to bounce here first, here second. Now, when you do the reflections, you do them in the reverse order that the ball would travel in. So I'm going to pick my reflection tool to click the hole and reflect it. Reflection one. Now, listen carefully here because this is the trickier item. The ball, we want it to bounce in this region somewhere and head towards this item here. So we do not reflect the original hole. No, 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 no. We reflect the image. So I'm going to now pick the reflect tool and I'm going to reflect my hole over that line there. Now, I think it's there. Let's go see. Uh, ooh, there it is. Now, you might have to do a little resizing uh, to make this all work. Uh, which is fine, that's expected. Now let's see the magic. The ball would travel towards that reflection. Notice it was the hole's reflection of the reflection. Then it strikes, I gotta look at it closely, strikes and travels towards the other reflection. And then it travels from there into the hole. Bam! That's how it works. Reflect and a reflect of the image, a composite double reflection. Beautiful stuff. Leave all of that in there so I can see how you solve the problem. Good job.